Hello everyone, I'm Johnny's Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here in Kaiserreich to the abomination that I've created in this world. So, right now I'm not showing you Europe, but basically here it is. So, let me explain what's going on. China, we beat Russia. We lost like 2.5 million versus their 5.5 to 6 million soldiers in the Russian Empire. As you can tell, we now have the Russian Republic. Let's let time go on. But we have the Russian Republic. That was Transamir, as you can tell by the flag, and Boris here. Uh, I had to go into console commands, and for the Transamir Republic, make sure that they could manually, you know, push their claims, go west, final solution, which sounds really odd, but, uh, new Russia, reclaiming your lands, they're still my puppet, so, I've definitely given the Russian Republic a lot of its claims and cores, like Ufa, it's core territory, so, also want to talk about the Indo-Chinese Union. Now, we think of the Indo-Chinese Union as, you know, Vietnam, Cambodia, Siam. Not even Siam, but Cambodia, Laos, and stuff like that. I figured, you know what? Reduce the lag. Reduce the number of countries in-game. And basically create a Southeast Asian mega puppet. So, I took out the German East Indies, Maimonar, Burma, Siam, and put them all under one roof. So, they're going to like each other whether they like it or not. Um, which might be a little bit broken since they have a lot of manpower now. Or relatively enough. Oh, uh, they're social democrat. Also, I did, I did personally take Singapore, just because that's pretty important for us. There's a lot of Chinese in Singapore. And, well, I own North Borneo because, well, there's really no one else that would take it. You know, so, whatever. Uh, Dominion of India actually beat out the Entente, no, the Bharatiya Commune, the Red India faction, so. That's kind of surprising, not gonna lie. A little surprising, actually. And I have been trying to get ready for war, potential war against them in case they want to go to war with me maybe they do maybe they don't you guys are actually gonna come down here that'll be good and I'm definitely gonna need to increase my infrastructure for everything as well because I don't know what the Entente's gonna do because I want to take out the legation cities oh no Red India's still right there cool because I'm doing the my last focus that I'm not done yet everything else is pretty much done that I can do but with the fate of the legation cities the concessions to the Europeans and the federal fellow imperialists have been an insult to our sovereignty for far too long. One way or another, they will be freed from foreign exploitation and returned to us. Basically, you know, with Russia dead, Southeast Asia my puppet, Korea is my puppet. Um, let me explain this. In Europe, well, with the fall of Russia, I figured there's no one I could really use here for Finland. So, if I could take out... Oh, wait, hold on. Hold the phone. Yeah, I didn't kill you off because you were in the Russian... Empire's puppet, but we have a white piece? No, you have... You're independent now. As well as the German Republic. Hmm. That could be a problem. I could kill them off. But I don't really care. I really don't. I can actually probably kill off the German Republic if I want to, but I'm justifying on someone else, maybe? No, I'm not. You know what? Let's do that. For fun. Uh, so, like I said, Eastern Europe. Someone told me to release Poland, so I'm like, okay, I'll release Poland. And then I gave Poland cores on all this territory just because I wanted a very, very strong Eastern European country that could balance out against Russia and maybe against a third international. So, you know what? It said United Baltic States? No. Poland. White Russia? Poland. Ukraine? I'm sorry if you're Ukrainian or any part of these nationalities, but it's now Poland. Don, Don Kaban Union? Now Polish. Uh, except I did release the Georgian Republic. I did manually go to war with the Armenian nation. It is 1947, so... Went to war with them, just gave it a rush to Georgia, so. I might go to war with the Ottomans just because I want to kill off the rest of the Germans. Here's the plan for the rest of this campaign, though. Uh, I want to kill off everyone who was responsible for the center of humiliation. So, for example, the Germans, they've been kicked out of their homeland. They're now down here. They needed to be fully kicked out. we got to take them over. Which means I needed to go through the Ottomans to get down to Africa to kill them off. That also means I need to kill off Canada... And the United States, at minimum. And of course, Japan is obviously no-brainer. I gotta kill them. I'm not interested in Australasia. I really don't care about them. But if they want to go to war with me, then so be it. But anyways, we have the Chinese National Revolution. Send the ultimatum to the legation cities. Not sessions, cities. Now, I already have armies all placed around here. So, if they want to fight me, I am more than ready. So, and I could return Russian lands, which basically means mess up... Well, not Romania, but, uh... Uh, where are Russian lands? Oh, no. It might be Romania. I don't know. Doesn't matter. So, good. And we can choose a national focus. I could get more political power, but there's no point to. 
I need to build a lot of military factories because I lost a lot of military factories after that war, so. Good. Do that. Awesome. Got a lot of guns. Actually, we still have a massive... We had a massive deficit of artillery. Um, yeah, you can do something like that. It's not bad. Mm, you can do that as well. Eh, you know what? Glory by another 10. I'm going to make some fighters still. Tactical bombers are pretty important. We need more steel. I'm, I'm importing quite a bit of steel. A lot of a chromium, though, from Transamir, which is great, great, great. Steel from Transamir. Thank you. And aluminum from... Yeah, why not? Thank you. And I'm trying to make a navy as fast as possible. Obviously, my ships, I only have 18. Not great. Naval Bomber 3s. I've, I've got some Naval Bombers, which is awesome. Uh, Air Doctrine. I've been doing more Air Doctrine stuff. I still don't have nuclear bombs yet. But I do need jet engines. There's really no point for us to have nuclear stuff. I mean, I guess I need time to build up, you know, actual bombs from reactors, but whatever. Oh, what are you guys doing? Oh, my tanks are over here. Oh, I stationed them over here because... I don't know. Doesn't matter. Take out the German state. That'd be kind of nice. Only a little piece of Germany as well. Faction mode. I wish I had my own faction. That'd be really nice. But I don't. Third International is like... They basically formed a proto-European Union at this point. Like, that's the European Union. Well, the time of this recording. Maybe except for uh, that country. And not the inclusion of this country. And even Norway. Anyway, reply from the Legation cities. The Legations have refused our just demands and have pleaded with Europe for protection. But this won't save them when our armies are red. Or are ready. The only question is, should we go far as to attack them? I get a war goal against them. Good. Oh, we got more divisions. Another boobing division? Sure. I have reorganized some of my armies around. Uh, Tai Bay. You guys are just Coast Guards, I believe. Please keep going there. Yep, that'd be good. Um, I mean, I'm pretty much ready to go. Oh, what, what, why, are you, why, are you, why are you disorganized? Does everyone, doesn't everyone have orders? Oh, excavation one. Finally, I'm done with excavation. Still not done with everything else here, but whatever. It just takes so much time. Let's get some nuclear bombs. Yes, please. Yes, please. Your guys are looking pretty good. Uh, are we ready for a war with the Entente? For the most part. I, mean, I really don't share much of a border with them, except location cities and India. I might go to war with Japan just because, well, they have guaranteed the location cities. But I really don't care. Like, Japan, yeah, they got a massive navy. But other than that, their divisions aren't great. And I've been building up an air force. A little bit. A little bit of one. You guys. Both of you. Come over here. Uh, do that. Don't do that, actually. Stay in Vladivostok. Go home, repair, and hang out. Get a couple beers. Hang out. Because now it's time to go to war with... These guys. Let's see all of you all. Uh, you guys go right on ahead. You guys go right on ahead, you guys go right on ahead, and then you guys... Well, you're kind of hanging out. Awesome. Good. I will go to war with you guys. And if you guarantee them, you are going to die. Well, you're going to die anyways. It doesn't really matter. Oh, Canada. Good. Alright, so now I'm at war with the entire Entente. Well, they they own it. They want it. They want to die. So be it. Go forth and reclaim Taiwan. Cool. Uh, I do a couple fighters here. Not a lot. Only 2,200. Ah, there you go, Dominion of India. Good to see you there, my friend. Good. Give me another 800 planes here. Uh, not 900, please. Thank you. Plop, plop, plop. Uh, it doesn't really matter where I put them. I just want a lot of naval bombers. Oh my goodness, look at all these fighters I got since I killed off. J Japanese. Oh my goodness, there's so many planes I gotta get rid of. I need more naval... Oh my gosh, I need so many naval bombers. Oh, heavy fighters. That's cool. Um, do we at least have a hundred somewhere? There's a hundred of ours. Yeah, there's that. And I'm joined here with my Chinese cat, Pinky. Uh, do 200 more. Cool. You two, plop, plop. You plop yourselves over there, and then you plop yourselves over there. Good. I should have put more Coast Guards right here. Awesome. Good. Ah, uh, America. Yeah, for now... Yeah, yeah, why not? Oh, good job, guys. And, oh, we're going to need quite a few more Coast Guards. Good, we own those territories. Shanghai will be ours. Ningbo is currently ours. You guys are doing great. Hong Kong, Macau, come home. Come home. Good. And for India, immediately just go ham. I don't know how strong they are. Where you get that? 
Let's see. They're still fighting the Bharatiya Commune, which I hope they capitulate soon. Oh, they got a, oh my god, they got a lot of manpower. The fall of Hong Kong, good. The Pearl of the East is finally secured under Chinese control. You guys have about a million manpower and up to 40 divisions there? Holy cow. Yeah, that'd be great. Yeah, guys, come on, come on. The fall of Shanghai, good. Legation cities, they're gone. They deserve to be gone. They, they're an imperialist puppet. Are you guys fighting anybody? You're still fighting the Entente, but you're not doing very much. Disappointed. Uh, another boobing division. There you go. Uh, have we taken all the cities? We already have taken all the cities. Oh, do that too. And Guangzhou. Ooh. Here we go. Plop. Plop. Anywhere else did I miss? I probably missed somewhere because there's so many independent little cities and stuff like that in China. Unfortunate, but oh well. Such is history. Good. Uh, you guys are kind of bored now. Except for you. Continue Asia. I'll probably lose that. I'm at, I'm at war with these guys. So, here's the campaign idea. Oh, I can kill off these guys. Ooh, how about you all come to Singapore? And we kill off these guys. You all. Um, let's see. I need more stuff. So, one, two, three. There you go. Go down to 50. That should give us enough. I need more. Oh my god, so much aluminum. Oh, naval bombers? Yeah, let's get some better naval bombers. I need a ton of naval bombers and a ton of aluminum now. Holy cow. Transamir, you're a great guy. Don't you know that? You're really a great, great guy. Awesome. That's why we love you. There you go. Now we should be able to make enough of everything. Oh! Okay, they peaced out. Great! Now I'm still at war with the rest of the Entente, as well as Japan. Which is fine, I don't really care. Uh, got some pretty strong puppets. We got 2,000 things here. Do I have any Fighter 3s? I might. I might have already passed them by. Half of these guys are just fighters, you know. Maybe not. Cool. Let's come over there. Wow, look at all those non-aggression packs. Any set of naval bombers. I'll take that. Good. Plop, 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 plop. And you guys do Straits of Malacca. Uh, yes. Wallachia, yes. Hanover, South German Union. I just want to do this slowly just because I don't want a non-aggression pact with Germany. The regular Germans. God dang it. Ugh, Transamir, come on, man. You're literally killing my war effort here. But not really. Any ships? Any ships? Anyone want to invade China? How about I invade India instead? Good. How long will it take for me to go to war with the German Republic? Oh, they have no division still. Good. Takes about another hundred days. That's fine. Whatever. Doesn't matter. I would like to see the French commune do something. Like, come on, guys. Come on. You're still over here fighting these guys. India will be ours. Ooh, we also playing against a couple of those boys. All right, uh, Cuba, dude, dude, he's got an awesome head. Look at that, Cuba. Oh, what happened to Cuba? Oh, the radical socialists are taken out. That's sad, quite sad. All right, who else can't give me my stuff? Transamir, you're okay. Oh, well, everyone can give me my stuff. That's good. That's good. India's looking not terrible. Oh, I need to call you guys into the war, don't I? Yeah. Uh oh. Oh, we sunk an Australian, Australian convoy. We're going to lose that. I don't really care. Good. Oh, they're going to come back with a vengeance. Oh, boy. Yeah, take out Nepal. That'd be great. Guess we're doing okay for now. We have plenty of supplies except for modern tanks, which is fine. Close air support. I don't want this clogging up my things here. I'm a little surprised that they're not trying any more naval invasions. Because I know the AI literally just cheats when doing naval invasions. They just go. Like, it's they're allowed to just go instead. Unlike us. So, um, heavy fighters don't need them. Even though they're pretty good. I could probably use them, honestly. Uh, I did buff Poland probably too much, to be honest with you. 
14 million manpower. So uh, probably a little bit too much. Oh well. Good, good, good. Um, good. You took that tile. Awesome. India, well, you chose your fate. Uh, we all choose our own fates here. 22 divisions versus one beefy boy. Cool. Yeah. Sounds good to me. We're not winning in eastern India. That's fine. Against all these extra attacks. I don't know if they'll be able to win. Who's actually over here? Oh, uh, we don't even own this. Oh, we, we only have military access through their lands. I can't actually put planes there. That sucks. Uh, fighters. You guys are not doing very much. Why? Put any more tactical bombers, please? Nice, I do. I get about 17,000 manpower a month. Roughly 18,000. It's pretty good. Uh, throw you right there. You're almost deployed. And then, plop, plop. Ace pilot promoted. Very good. Very nice. You guys in the north are doing okay as well. Good. Ooh, losses? No. Oh, there's a little bit of a navy there, though. You know what that means. Time to sink, sink, sink. Oh, some of you guys are really experienced. Nice. Yeah, maybe I should have focused a little bit more on naval bombers in the interwar period, even though there really wasn't that much time for the interwar period. Holy cow. Uh, mm, Transamur, I'm not sure why I got rid of that. Oh, they must have raised their level. I've been using them quite a bit, actually, so makes sense. So, Transamur, there's a reason why I liberated you. But you're not going to be liberated. Forever my puppet. Yeah, I don't know why they... The devs let them do that. Oh, actually, you got planes all over here. What are you guys doing? You're dead? No, you're not. We don't need to talk about that. You guys... 700 of you guys, wow. I don't think I deleted any armies. But, nonetheless, there you go. Good, 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 good. Ooh, 600 more guys? Wow. A lot of fighters. Not bad. Could be better, I suppose. Actually, the managed subjects. Yeah, Russian Republic? Yeah, no. I don't know why you can't lower autonomy level. It's one thing if you can't annex them, but why can't I lower their autonomy level? That makes no sense. Makes no sense. Keep that on for now. There you go. You know what? There you go. I'll, I'll just buy stuff from France. There you go. I don't want your autonomy to grow too much. Daily autonomy gain for them. 408 turns into... 402. Good. Oh, that's a commune. Awesome. Get some more of this stuff. How many minutes have we lost? Wow, 7 million from the Third International versus 12 million? Jesus, guys. Uh, you know what? I will call these guys in. I'll call them all in so I can bait enemies into trying to attack me. That's a lot of losses so far. Uh, India. We've killed off about 400,000 of them. Not bad so far. Pretty good. Pretty good. I might just give it to all of Red India, just because they are kind of my ally. They did help us out earlier, so. Oh, good. Good job, guys. Um, really, I don't want to use my navy too much. It's really not that good. We have a ooh, level 4 like cruiser. I'm still trying to make these ships, god dang it. They're taking forever to make. That's fine. I'm really surprised I haven't found too much of their navy. Hmm. Let's see. Four. I can only send four divisions at a time because I did research transport uh, ships. You definitely have to come there. Uh, Georgetown. And there. There you go. That should be good enough. You guys come up there. Cool. Nice. Let's another convoy. Good. 
The first of very many. Alright. You're all too independent right now. I don't like it. Good. Do that. And go. One big old unified line. Convoy sunk. Good. What do we need? Anything? Do we need anything? Naval bombers are coming along. Things are coming along very nicely. Fighters, naval bombers. Up to 50. Supplies are looking pretty okay. That's releasing guy sunk, gone, dead, bueno. How much longer do we go to war with these guys? 40 days. The game's pretty laggy, as you can tell. I might take out Sweden, too. Alright. Oh, we got a lot of political. Oh! Oh, yeah, we can integrate all these guys. Yeah, do that. Uh, Industrialized Shanghai. Good. Chinese United Front. Was someone trying to invade me? Sounded like someone was. Sounded like it. Oh, look! Beauty! Go ahead and hold. Kill him off, please. You're welcome, Red India. You're really, really flippin' welcome. And my ships. I gotta be really careful with these guys. <sighs> Come to here. Dutchies and he should will fall, and then I might the Australasian Confederation and move around these Pacific Islands, destroying ships as we go, and then destroy. I forgot about this. Crud. Japan. That's okay. I think my guys have got it for now. Mm. Where are you guys at? Hanging out, having a good time. Pretty normal. Um. You guys can come up north. Why not? Have a good time with Japan. You guys... Eh, you're doing okay. You might as well be like that defensive army we started with in the, oh, the last couple episodes when we were at war with Japan. Just kind of form a front line there. Lost the plane. Whatever. No worries. Did our ships make it? Yes, they did. Awesome. Can you guys make it now down to here? Well, actually, make it down to here. Good. Ooh. Lost the plane in exchange for something else. That's okay. India's looking swell, I'm not gonna lie, looking pretty darn good. <sighs> Europe is such a mess. Gotta love it. America's just kinda hanging out. You guys are I wish the third international would actually do something. Oh, ah, oh, there goes India. Good job, guys. Good job. Still trying to make more military factories. Got up infrastructure. Infrastructure is always good. Ah, supplies, 1947. Rocket engines. Bueno, my friends, bueno. Oh, we own a good old chunk of this stuff. I don't mind letting the, uh, the Entente take all this stuff, so that we can easily just kill everyone else off here. That'd be very nice. Be very nice. Very, very nice. Alright, guys, you come down here, exterminate with extreme prejudice. I'm really disappointed that there's not enough Japanese ships around here. Hmm. There's 200 here. That's okay. It's not great. And split you. Now, so we have to take out Japan so we can get to America. That's going to be a big old pain in the butt. Invading America will be a massive pain in the butt, too. Good. Oh, we're getting, actually getting invaded. Interesting. Well, at least something's going on. Good. Korea, Korea should have enough strength by now to properly defend themselves. National identity, 40,000 strength, 13 divisions. Not a lot. But whatever. Whatever. Our supply up here. This is pretty good. We have great supply. Um, you guys just kind of hang out for now. That's looking pretty good. Over here. Doing okay. All right. I really don't care about India too much, so can I trade you a couple provinces? Start at least. No. Oh. You cannot create factions without having a national spirit to not do so. Um, that sucks. I can't even give you stuff. I'll give you military access, but we already have that kind of. Kind of sucks. Good. Good. Before we do anything else. 
Bismarck C, what's going on over here? Dead zone? Hmm. You all are going to be doing a little bit of convoy escorts here. Now, these planes, you, you got to be make sure you're doing really well around here. Really well. We're going to have probably a couple injuries around here. Into war bombers, tactical bombers, more naval bombers. I think so. You guys do this area. And then, tactical bombers. Oh, fighter threes. Uh, let's do get 200 of these guys. Where are you? There you are. Hello. Uh, I can do that too, because why not? Don't bomb the hell out of this area. Good. Have we lost any ships yet? No. Good. Oops, don't do that. Oh, I'm go for East Prussia next. Awesome. Something tells me that they have no defenses against us. Maybe a single division? I'll call them Poland. Also, I did research m medium tanks, or modern tanks, actually. Just so, you know, you see a little bit of less strength for these guys. That's because I'm trying to get modern tanks here. Good. Good. Oh, my goodness, there's a lot of divisions there. I doubt we'll be able to invade, but we'll see what happens. Mm, there we go. Yeah, there they go. They're probably not going to win. Because there's, yeah, six divisions there. How many divisions? Six? Yeah. Oh, no. oh, you guys keep going. You guys hold. Yeah. Go need some strategic bombers. There's a lot of guys there. How many divisions do these guys have? Eh, that's not bad. Nukes are way forward, though. Nukes are definitely... Ooh, Japanese Navy. Hello there. Are we ready for round two? Destroy them all? Yes, please. Yeah. Ooh, a couple planes were shot down. Awesome. You guys are doing okay. That's not bad. So only so many ships. Uh, can I do anything here? Not really. I'm pretty much done with all of this. I'm going to continue suppressing my subjects. How much further until we get to the next research slot or opened? Ah, oh, radar. I like radar. Radar's pretty good. Fighters are okay. Do that. Ooh, a few more of these guys. Ah, they ended their problems. That's disgusting. Ah, oh, don't do that with them. Do that with the Commune of France. There you go. A little bit more. Thank you. Friends of Europe, I can reduce my dependency on you. Thank you. And there you go. Better. Oh! Snap! Um, I really don't care about this area. I'm going to let the bar to be a Commune take as much as they want. I really don't care. I'm... I'll just give it all to India. I really don't care about this area. And are they gonna take any more? I might just take Nepal though. Hmm. No. Uh where are you, India? There you are. Take all states. Boom, there you go. And then I don't know. Thank you, Nepal. Cool! Good job, guys. Uh, Fina Paul. I really wanted to reduce lag. I don't want them alive. Sorry, guys. Sorry. Ooh. What is this? Nice. A couple ships here. Ah, oh, cruiser was sunk. Awesome. Hep the Hepsog was sunk. Lost a couple planes. That's not good. Good. So now we're... Oh, we're going to need some more fuel. Oh, a couple Japanese ships not having a good time here. Okay, it's gonna take a while for me to do. Mm, good. Muy bueno. Awesome. Good job, Barty Commune. Good job. Even though it was really me doing all that work. Oh well. And that's okay. Actually, I did want to take Nepal just because that gives me just maybe another factory slot. Maybe. Not much. I know. Now we're now doing a good number of damage on these guys. I like it. Well, some damage. Modern tanks looking better. I completely ignore the German front. CV naval bombers. Regular naval bombers. Yeah. Definitely want to increase my production up here as well. Naval bombers. There we go. I'm going to need some more fuel. I always need more fuel, man. 
This is a lot of factories we have. I am making a ton of factories. Oh my gosh. Maybe too many. Oh, we need more of this. Transomir, that's nice. Ottomans, sure. You guys? Good. That being said, you know what? I will cancel some of these guys. We, I know I've been working on these for a while. I just need more fuel. We honestly already have enough. I really don't care. I don't want that taking up too many slots for me, so... Oh, they already have 7 out of 7. God dang it. And... Good. Oh, what's going on around here? Ah, oh, Japanese light cruiser. Good. Lost two planes. Good. It's not looking too bad. Um, well, I'm worthy on time. We got radar. Let's get some basic strategic bombers. Anything else here? Ships will be made someday, 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 someday. Another thing around here. Good. Keep tracking their ships. You're doing a good job. Upgrades are coming along. That's okay. Uh, political power-wise, we're losing occupation. What are we occupying? There's a what the heck are we occupying? Hey, right. Australasian Confederation. Oh, oh, the German Republic. Ah. Oh, how are we not done with these guys yet? I would like a German puppet, please. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, good. Some convoys were sunk. Now, this is going to take me a while to do, I know. But, uh, that's why tomorrow you'll see probably the Dutch East Indies suffering quite a bit. If not completely under me. You'll see that Germany will be completely under me at the end of this episode, of course. Uh, Berlin. Couldn't hold out against anybody. Oh, we haven't even taken it yet. I'm good. Ooh, more dockyards. We can wait on that. I'll probably raise my conscription level, because I can. Uh, boobing. Very nice, very nice. A boobing division. Good. And I will have, hopefully, at least a few strategic bombers by the time we're done. Good, I don't need those factories, really. Oh, and you guys are just kind of hanging out. That's that's a bit too much. And maybe you'll see me tomorrow at war with the Ottoman Empire, because I like pissing off enemy nations now. But anyways, tomorrow will be another day. Let's do the fate of Germany. A new German Union. With a smile on our face. Cool. But with that in mind, guys... I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. Leave a like for Rudolph health daring mustache. And I will see you all tomorrow, like I said. And I hope you have a great, great rest of your day.